Good morning, everybody. And today I've got myself the Muji fountain pen. And I think this one is a fine point, extra fine. I don't even remember, but we're going to go ahead and do some doodling with this pen here and uh, see what we can come up with. And the sketchbook that I'll be drawing in today is the Sabriano sketchbook, which I bought this uh, like three years ago for only a dollar forty nine reduced. I know I'm very cheap. So we're going to go ahead and get this sketchbook ready. Flip to the page that is after my last one I did my last doodle and we're going to go ahead and start making some doodles in the sketchbook. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this pen. If you've done any drawing with the Muji fountain pen, um, what are some of your favorite pens to draw with? And, uh, do you prefer a fountain pen that is refillable with cartridges or do you prefer one that is uh, refillable with the inside of it to where you can dip it in ink and the suction of it pulls the ink up inside of it? Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, get started on Doodle and see what we can make. It's starting to look like fall outside. It's not quite as warm, but it's still in the upper 70s and low 80s and I thought about maybe going for a quick walk this morning but I didn't have breakfast yet I was hungry and I just wanted to stay home for a little bit and relax I've been kind of tired from the past couple of weeks between work editing videos and just doing a lot of things so I stayed inside Drank myself a small cup of coffee, had some breakfast, and just started working on this doodle. I got out my Muji fountain pen. I was going to start drawing with it, but it was almost completely out of ink. And I had to refill it. I haven't done any drawing with this pen for quite a while, so I went to refill it, and I realized that to refill this pen, I can just dip the pen into the ink bottle and twist the back of it so it pulls the ink up into the pen rather than taking the reservoir out and putting it into the ink bottle and twisting it to pull ink into it. Then I cleaned off the pen and I started making this doodle. As you can see, part of this drawing was already done I was working on it for maybe 15 minutes before, many months ago, with one of my technical pens like the Rotring or the Staler Isograph pen. And I had done a lot of drawings with my Rotring and my Staler's, and I wanted to do some fountain pen doodling. So I got this one out and just started making some lines. The other pens that I have, such as the Lamy Safari, the Twisby Eco T, the Nuller's Ahab, with those they work great, but just something about drawing with this pen, I like the grip of it. It's more comfortable to hold in my hand when I'm drawing. And with some of the other pens that are plastic, it seems like if it's warm out or my hands um, have a lot of moisture on them, the pen kind of slides out of my fingers and I don't feel like I have as good of a grip or control with a pen when I'm making my doodles. And um, yeah, everything's going good right now. I am um, just doing a lot of drawing and making breakfast, coffee, the usual. Not a whole lot of too much interesting stuff really happens other than the usual drawing and work. Other than that, um, everything's okay. I'll see you later and hope you have a great day.